Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. It has been too long since my last video. I had a lot of family drama, not gonna go into it. It's finally kind of easing up a little bit. Um, my son's done with school, so I'm not driving back and forth twice a day. Um, so now I have more time to do what I wanna do, which is make videos for you guys, read my pile of books that has to be read, all that good stuff. Um, but a few weeks ago, my sister and I had a witchy shopping day. And I have been wanting to talk about some of this stuff since that day. And I just haven't had a chance to. Um, our first stop was this new crystal shop that is, pun intended, a stone's throw away from my house um, called Scorp Zone. And, oh, it is a gorgeous, gorgeous crystal shop. Um, they have witchy stuff in there too. They're like a witchy shop with the main focus of crystals. And I bought this little crystal skull guy. Um, let's see, he's, yeah. Oh, so cute. Um, he was $15. Apparently my husband and I collect skulls. N never intended to have a skull collection. It just worked out that way. So I thought he would make a cute little addition and... They also have, um, on the counter where you, where you pay for stuff, they have a little box full of crystal, about this big, crystal willies. Still giggle like a 12 year old at the thought of these things. <laughs> They're just so tiny. Um, yeah, I didn't buy any of those. I don't think my sister did either, but it was fun to laugh at them. Um, and my sister, she bought quite a few things and she was looking at the tarot cards. And it looked like she was trying to decide on a deck. And I said to her, I said, hey, I'm not buying any tarot cards. These are all great, but I have enough tarot cards. So, but if I was going to buy a deck, I would get that one. And she picked it up and she was put it with her stuff and she went and checked out. And as soon as the kid scanned it, she turned around and she handed it to me. Jess, you're a brat, but thank you. Um, I love them. It's the Modern Witch Tarot. And I know you guys are familiar with this deck. I love it. I'm still trying to, with the arthritis in my thumbs, shuffling the cards is a little bit tricky. I have to do them in sections, which is fine. Um, but as I work with them more, they'll soften up and get easier to use. But uh, but they have re-inspired me to want to keep learning tarot. So this is a great deck. Um, we went to Witch Bitch Thrift, which is about 20 minutes from here. And they were not open. Unfortunately, Something had happened in that area way earlier that day, so they were closed. Um, and unfortunately, from what I understand, they are closing their storefront and will only be online from now on. Um, I'll put a link to their online shop down below, because even though I haven't been, I'm, I follow them on Instagram. And all the... Oh, all the collections that they put together for the for on Sundays and all her little videos. Oh, they're fantastic. So I will put a link down there. Even though I've never shopped there, I'm sure I mean, it's a woman owned small business. What's not to support? Um, then we went to a local witchy shop called curious goods, which is where I bought my first witchy book long time ago. Um, they don't have an online store. So I can't post anything for you for to check them out. And still considering, I mean, as big as she's gotten, she's still a smaller shop. And but jam packed with so much stuff. I don't think there's anything she doesn't have in there. Um, I didn't buy anything. My sister bought some incense, but there wasn't anything I needed. And any of the stuff that I wanted, I feel like I might already have. So I left empty handed. And then yesterday, my son and I went to Barnes & Noble because he had an appointment, so we figured we'd kill a little bit of time beforehand. And I looked at all the books. Well, not all the books, but I'm looking at all the witchy books, and some of them seem really great, and some of them seem really ridiculous, which you're going to get. Um, but I didn't buy any because I still have, you know, the stack that I haven't even cracked the spine on yet. So now I have time. I'm going to start reading. But I did... At the checkout, spot this. It's like a magazine, you know, like the 
like when Time does a magazine dedicated to like Princess Die. It's kind of like that. Um, the truth behind the legends and lore, witches. It's fun. I like it. I like. I look at the cover. Um, some of the information in here may not be a hundred percent accurate, so I wouldn't like take it all as a hundred percent truth. Which you know, it says the truth, but quick little Google search will show some of it is not actually correct. Fact check, people. Fact check. Um, but you know, the, the, the pictures inside are nice and, and I'm like, glad I bought it for $13.99. Yes. I'm glad I bought it. It's, I've, I've read about halfway through it. It's, it's fun. Um, I would buy it again. Cause, cause I, I never seen anything like it before. Um, it's on Amazon. Cause I looked for it before I sat down to make this video. So that if anybody was interested and they might want to get a copy, um, it's even more, it's $17.99 on Amazon plus I think $3.99 shipping. It's not on Prime. That, I, I don't think it's worth that price. Um, so if you have a Barnes & Noble near you and you want a copy, go. I would say go get it locally rather than ordering it online. I think they have like a, a subscription magazine too. Um, if I can find it and it does exist, I'll put a link to that below as well. That might be something fun to try out for a little while. Um, something different, but I wouldn't spend the Amazon price for this. Um, I think that's about it. I haven't had a, a lot of time for a lot of stuff. Um, but now I'm getting back on track. Things have settled down. I can read my books. I have so many witchy videos I want to make for you guys. Um, but if there's something specific you'd like to see, please feel free to leave it below in the comments. Um, I'd love to hear your ideas. That's about all I have for today. Thank you for watching this video. I hope to see you in the next one. Bye. Cheers. Oh, and subscribe. Come back. It'll be fun. I promise. Bye.